Hey guys, our next question is solution for the problem is for the cone clutch. So the question is, in a cone clutch, maximum and minimum contact surface radius is 150 mm and 125 mm respectively, and semi cone angle is 20 degree. Coefficient of friction is 0.25. Allowable normal pressure is 140 kN per meter square. Now for uniform pressure intensity, the axial load and power transmitted. At speed of 1000 rpm, so we have to calculate this uniform pressure intensity and the axial load and power transmitted. So let us write the data. So first the data is maximum and minimum contact surface radius. So let R1 be maximum radius that is 150 mm, which is equivalent to 10 raised to minus 3 meter. 0.15 meter and R2 is 125 mm into 10 raised to minus 3 that is 0.125 meter and the semicone angle is alpha equals to 20 degree and the, the coefficient of friction is 0.25 that is mu equals to 0.25 next the allowable normal pressure is 140 kN so P max equals to 140 kN per meter square now we will convert it to Newton that is 140 into 10 raised to 3 Newton per meter square the next is RPM that is speed equals to N equals to 1000 RPM so we have to calculate the axial load and the power transmitted so the solution So let us start with the axial load axial load can be given as W equals to 2 pi C R1 minus R2 in case of cone clutch where C can be written as since we know P max equals to C by R minimum or C by R2 which is minimum so we know the P max that is 140 into 10 is to 3 and R minimum or R2 that is 0.125 meter so we get C as 175.00 and correspondingly W by putting R1 and R2 as 0.15 and 0.125 we get W as 2748 2748 Newton now we need to find the torque it is torque transmitted by uniform wear theory the formula is torque equals to half mu w r1 plus r2 so we know the all the values that is mu equals 0 0.25 w equals to 2748 where r1 equals to 0 0.15 and r2 equals to 0 0.125 so by putting value we get our sorry T as 276.27 cosec alpha where alpha equals to 20 degree so this is the answer now we need to calculate the power transmitted so the power transmission can be written as power equals to 2 pi n t upon 60 
since we have calculated TS 276.26 and N we have 1000 so by putting here we get 28.93 into 10 raised to 3 watt that is equivalent to 28.93 kilowatt so this is the power transmitted thanks guys for watching